brought me. I guess it's time to have the bug man come out. I hope it was this new Glottis Brewery Company that my buddy brought me. Here's beer number two. Totally naked. So I'm uh I'm starting to starting to feel a pattern about this brewery. Two women totally naked. I'm liking this place. Can't wait to go visit. So we'll try this one. I really like that other one. So now we'll see how we like this one. That one's better. The uh, two women are two women are always better. to you Rico here I'm trying to oh it's pretty good uh, buddy of mine he just bought a house in Michigan and now that he's a uh, Michiganian I like that Michiganian yeah he's found a little brewery company there and it's called uh, I don't even know what the brewery is called. New Gladys, New Gladys uh, Brewing Company. He brought me back a couple sample beers, and this one is the Two Women. It's got a little, like, real simple, uh, well, I like it. It's Two Women. Anyway, I'm trying that tonight while we're cooking for you. That's actually pretty good. I like that. Um, what am I cooking? I'm cooking today, tonight, right now. It's about a two-inch, two-inch ribeye. I picked them up last night at one of the little uh, <coughs> local uh, carne asadas, little meat shops, Mexican meat shops. I'm going to be grilling it. Well, not grilling it. I'm going to sear it in the cast iron, finish it off in the oven. Uh, see it all the time on TV. I just got done watching Master Chef, and they were, uh, they were doing some cooking. And so I, oh, shit. I, I, oh, shoot. That's, I said shoot. Haven't eaten yet. Haven't did a cooking video. I tried to, I, I'm getting into this again. Uh, we're going to do it. So what I'm going to spice it with tonight is just a simple Rico salt, pepper, garlic. Salt, pepper, garlic. And some paprika. And I'm not going to be stingy with it. I'm just going to put some spice down here and we're just going to, we're just going to roll it in it. And that'll, uh, That'll get it on the edges, because we want the whole steak to uh, enjoy the flavor of the spices. We're going to sear this off in a little uh, Chosen Foods avocado oil that I get it smart and final. It's kind of like a small Costco, a small Sam's Club. So we're just going to... Put a liberal amount. Now you'll you'll never hear Rico talk a whole lot about liberal. Uh, we'll just put it all in because we're done. We'll let the oil heat up. We have the oven uh, preheated. Oh, okay. Back, 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 uh, back pedal. We're gonna sear it off in the cast iron, finish it in the oven. I may have not already said that, but I did it again. Yeah, we didn't say. Okay. So work. I gotta get some tongs I like. I really don't don't have a set. And we're just gonna sear off the edges. Worcestershire on it, because I like it that way. We're 
we're going to throw a little bit of the two girls in there. Pretty thick steak. So I might cook it uh, 10 minutes or so on one side, flip it, and call it good. Okay, so they've been in the oven about 20 minutes or so. So we're just going to flip them over like that sizzle I'm hearing. Again, I like the uh, little Worcestershire. And that's the end of it. Okay, these look, uh, these look delicious. Look at that thing. That thing is gorgeous. We're just going to put a, uh, a little pad, couple pads of butter on this. amazing. Um, if these turn out and I like this this uh, place I got the meat, I'll go get a few more of these and I invite a couple people over and we'll have a little uh, a little grill, a grill time, a little grill time, a little grill time with Rico. Well here's the thinner, oh that's, and there's a, there's a medium well to, to me. So, for you all, you are really good. I may, I might eat both, I might eat both of these steaks tonight. This, this is, good heaven. Mm. Guys, this is the Tide Dyed Cowboy. Hoping you have a blessed day tomorrow. As we say here at uh, Base Camp Rico, keep on cooking, grilling, and smoking. Salute, my friends.